Hi, I'm Josh Olson, and this is Trailers from Hell, and I want to talk to you about a statistical aberration. In the 80s, Canon Films made exactly 6,324 movies, exactly seven of which are any good. They are Runaway Train, Street Smart, Tough Guys Don't Dance, Barfly, The Texas Chainsaw Massacre 2, Ninja 3, The Domination, and the movie I'm going to talk to you about right now, 52 Pickup. We have to have positive identification. we got to get some strong evidence. By all rights, this movie should have been terrible. John Frankenheimer was coming off a bad slump over the past decade or so. And with the exception of The Big Bounce many years earlier, no one had ever really taken a shot at translating one of Elmore Leonard's idiosyncratic crime novels to film. And worst of all, it was a canon film. It was a risky venture. It's an odd cast, but oh my God, does it deliver. It's smart, it's funny, it's got twists and turns, it's beautifully written, the characters are fully fleshed out. I should mention that Elmore Leonard wrote the script. And it's quirky as hell. All the things we take for granted today from a good Elmore Leonard crime movie, as there have now been dozens, as well as the wonderful show Justified, which is probably one of the best shows on TV. But this is the first, really, and the first time they got it right. As good as Roy Scheider is, as good as Anne Margaret is, as good as the script and the direction are, it's the bad guys that make it. Robert Trevor is hilarious and creepy and slimy, but fully realized and human. The great Clarence Williams III takes a truly terrifying psychopath who does horrible things like that, and yet weirdly makes us care for him. But at the heart of it all is John Glover in one of his first big roles, just killing it. I'd never seen him in anything before, and this is one of his first big parts. He is just this creepy, terrifying character, a murderous blackmailer who makes porn on the side and terrifies everyone around him and also has an accounting degree. And a very perverse charm that will make you both love him and want to see him smashed with a bulldozer.